My name is Amy Papola. I am the auctioneer at Capo Auction. I became interested in arts and antiques through my family and then proceeded to study art history as an undergraduate and started as an intern in the art industry. I focused on three different areas of the market. One would be gallery, one would be non-for-profit, and one was auction. Auction was the most interesting. So I started at Sotheby's right in college and continued there for about 10 years and then wound up going into my own business independently. And I've been an independent contractor for 10 years. Robert Berman and I met through a common colleague who knew of me as a collection manager and also as a local auctioneer. I've handled all of their sales. We are going into our fourth year. At that rate, it's a sale a month, and I did guesstimate we've sold about 34,000 lots. At 550, $600. Back to Michael at six. Say 650. 650 to B. On the telephones with B at 650. 700 with Michael. Often people will ask me, do I have a particular chant? Do I sound like someone who you would see on some of those reality TV shows? And I don't. I actually speak fairly clearly. I sound exactly like I do right now. I just talk a little bit more quickly. So when the bidding gets going, I don't want to waste any time. Four, we'll open the bids at $200. But you want to hit every single uh, word so that everyone understands in the room exactly where the bidding is. So if we have 350, 375, 400, 425, 450, 475, 500, five now 50s, 550, 600, 650, 67, and you keep going until the bidding stops. 900, Michael, you're in the lead at 900. Going once, twice, sold. So people who got too excited by putting their arm up and enjoying that process realize that that's actually their money that they're spending, and they will actually come forward and then say that, oh, the auctioneer went too quickly. I didn't mean to. Lot 134, five modern works, various themes, mediums, and sizes. We'll open the bids here, 150 The sale bucks. is a marathon. My job is to pull together all of the different interests of conducting this sale. We try to clock about 100 lots an hour. Whew, okay. So to keep up at that pace, you can't come in tired. You can't come in with a bad voice. It's all online at one, Live Auctioneers at 125. I don't do anything the day before the auction. I won't have a glass of wine. I don't talk on the phone. I don't do anything extraneous. I don't work out for six hours. Fair warning at 125. Sold 125, paddle 800. You come in with a couple of canisters of tea. I generally take two rest breaks for about 10 or 15 minutes, um, breaking up the to, to break up the sale. The auction in business is a great business. Everyone finds their niche in the auction community. It takes a huge team to pull it together. So if you're a visual person, if you're a research person, if you're uh, just interested in being surrounded by pretty things, how where else can you do that? And, and be a part of a live show at the same time. Be fair warning against the room at 70. Sold, $70, paddle 19.